Hey guys, welcome back to Watch Dogs 2. I don't know if you've noticed, but this is going to be officially the third day in a row that we upload Watch Dogs 2. This was going to be a game that I was going to upload like once a week. But I've got to be honest, the story has actually started getting better and better and better. There's been more drama and overall, it, it's, it's getting really good. And of course, next week we got Mafia 1 Remake, which is... I'm just super stoked for that game. And I got to make sure that I got my entire schedule cleared to make sure i bring as many episodes on that story as possible i'm also finishing this game asap because well watchdogs legion is pretty close to coming out and i really didn't want to play the game unless i kind of played this one at least i don't want to be like a weirdo like oh i've never played any of the watchdogs and you know here i am you know so yeah anyways thanks for tuning in i've been kind of looking at how many missions we have left or main operations and honestly we're almost we're, we're pretty close to the end what do you guys think i mean unless what the article that i read is incorrect but i think we've got like three or four main operations left and then we're good now, we're relatively close sorry i was using my thigh to turn oh there's a little puppy here oh hello there little puppy what is that what dog is that Oh, that's a cute dog. Who's a good boy? That's a cute dog. Okay, here we are at the beach. What a beautiful fucking scenery, dude. I've been enjoying this game more now than than before. Wait for it. Wait for what? Well, I was hoping for some kind of dramatic reveal, but my time is... It's a Galilei rocket, so what, man? Yeah, well, that there Galilei rocket is number four. And the satellites they're carrying? All blue. Oh, shit. Yeah. It's just got interesting. Mm -hmm. Those satellites are putting a lot of data out of our reach. This is next level shit, my friend. You've been waiting for your chance to hit Bloom. Oh, well, yeah, now we can hit him fucking hard. You think about putting a little something something on the next satellite launch and piggybacking into orbit? Uh-huh. You a crazy motherfucker, man. I'm out of this world, baby. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> you drive. Yeah. I like his hat, Mr. Poop. I'm extremely tired, man. I went to sleep at 5.30 in the morning last night. And um, I'm all over the place right now. So we are actually really far from our destination. I'm going to get in this car. Get in, dude. Get in the damn car, Ray. Drop right off at the hacker space. I kind of wish we would fast travel or have the ability to. Then again, we probably missed the dialogue. Drop me off at the hackerspace. I'll look through our intel on Galilee and talk you through the building. If this works, we'll have a Martian's eye view of Bloom's server farm and all the sweet, juicy data contained therein. A big company like Bloom must have server farms across the country. Well, with any luck, we'll key into one farm and use it to find the others. We've been trying so long to keep up with Silicon Valley. I want DedSec to be on the same playing field. For everything we've done, we still don't know exactly what Dushan's up to. You think we'll find dick pics? Have you been listening to any <laughs> of our convo, Satara? If dick we get picks. a hold of a Dushan dick pic, we have the ultimate leverage. Yeah, especially if it's small or warty. <laughs> Guys. And knowing him, his dick probably has its own fucking man bun on it. Dude. <laughs> hipster dick. I like, I like. Oh, hipster, Hi, so that's a new one. Dick. Okay. I only wear skinny condoms. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't circumcised before it was cool. <laughs> All right, I'm boys sure and girls. A little, yeah, a little right, too much right, info guys. here, right? You know that's, what I'm saying? <laughs> We've upset pops over here. Yeah, you call when you get to Galilee. They'll have a satellite waiting for you. Me and one of your magic clipper chips. Magic, yes. Clipper chip? Go fuck yourself. Ever think you'd make it this far? 
Honestly, I never thought this far was possible. So I guess that's a no, right? Yeah. I don't know if we've ever been to this hacker space. We've got like, yeah, we've never been here. Stop! How many hacker spaces do we have? Huh, is this Ray's house? Oh, this is new. Oh, this is new. Ray, man, I gotta tell you, I used to be a sucker for rockets. They were my jam growing up. Don't get too excited, Pee Wee. I've heard of the measures Galanet goes to to protect their intellectual property. Hmm? One wrong move and you'll be in a whole world of trouble. We've been in a world of trouble for a while now. So break down what I got to do at Galilee. Hold on to your habaneros. I'm downloading a schematic of the building. Just let me know when you get there. Yo, Marcus. Want me to sing you a driving song? Well, I do have a radio wrench. Thanks anyways. Yo, Tebow. Want me to sing... What? I was trying to blow up the thing on the ground in front of the dude with the motorcycle when he turned he'd blow up and I didn't know it was actually underneath me and I I blew myself up guys okay Not much. What's new with you? I'm an absolute idiot anyways I got off the freaking dialogue Bloom's been launching multiple satellites with Galileo's help get to Galileo's hangar and plan the exploits on the last satellites to find out what they're up to excuse me sir uh or ma'am ma'am I'm gonna need that ma'am I'm sorry Sorry, I, I will return it some other time. Right now, I've got somewhere to be. 911, state your emergency. Shit. Something's happening. We need the police to come <laughs> out here. Imagine hijacking a woman to get her motor <laughs> motor cross. Oh, that's fucked up. All right, so we're here. Okay, this building is quite impressive, and I also feel like it's going to be really difficult to get into this place. Just saying. We are here. Um. Alright, T-Bone, I'm here. I got the building layout in front of me, but I'm blind over here. I can patch you in through the surveillance system. Hmm. There's a little checkpoint leading to the building. The CCTV network runs through there. I'll see what I can do. And here we have the quadcopter that thankfully we actually bought. All right, so here we got, uh, we got, wait, what? We got this, unlock that. We got that. We got this, unlock that one, go down. There we go. Okay, bring this down here. And bada bing, bada boom. Just like that. Got it all figured out, baby. What happens if you don't have the quadcopter? Like, does the game make you buy it? Or do you have to, like, climb on top of the roof and do it like that? Or, I don't know. I can see. It's a miracle, Marcus. Excellent. You got my back now? I got your back, your fourth, and your side to side, bro. <laughs> Dope. Yeah. Alright, so. Hey, um, yeah. You've been now that we've got some backup, let's see if we can, uh, let's see how we can tackle this. Welcome to Galilee. From here, you want to get to the clean room. It's environmentally controlled, full of sensitive equipment, so try not to leave any prints. What's in the clean room? The chip I gave you is no good without a mobo. If I'm reading this brief correctly, the kind we're looking for are stored there. Oh no. Hi there. Hey. Okay, did that work? Greetings to you. Not my How are you doing, man? Okay. Can I come in here? Restricted area. 
Minding my own business. Yeah, that's right. You better mind your own business. Okay, so I think we're on the right path. This is all restricted area right now. Oh, baby! Keep it in your pants, Marcus. They've got the whole place locked down with trip lasers and guys with guns. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Yo, this is like super crazy. I'm like fucking paranoid here, okay? I'm nervous, man. So we're here. Okay, this is exactly where our robot was. What if I use the quadcopter? All systems functioning normally. Got to go all the way over here. Status all clear. Hi. I think we need to hijack one more thing. Yeah, we gotta hijack that. Okay, so I'm gonna open this up. I didn't think I was gonna have to use this thing, but honestly, I was wrong. <laughs> Look at the quad cop to go. Sorry, buddy. This is a hands-on operation. Your hands. Uh. Shit. Maybe right here. Physical hack. Unlock stores connected to the closed network. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. People often ask me why I put so much time and energy into pushing out there into space when it's so far and so empty. Let's look at just our own little space pebble. It would take us lifetimes to experience all the culture, all the color of our planet, but we do feel like we have a pretty good handle on it at least. It's getting harder and harder to really surprise us with anything. I absolutely believe there are other planets just as teeming with life out there for us to find. They're potentially filled with new cultures, with impossible colors. As a human being, I was born with a thirsty sponge for a brain, and it wants to soak up things it has never tasted before. Oh my I god, lady, shut up! With the money and the power to find ways to hurl thirsty sponges through space aboard ridiculously complex machinery. I realize I may never get to drink up the results, but I'm going to do my best to make sure humanity will. I almost just got caught, dude. Like, literally. Like, I almost just... That was so close. Okay, so we're here. There we go. I don't think the quadcopter can do that, so I had to bring the drone over here. I didn't have to bring myself here, but you know, I'm an overachiever, baby. We got this. Now we can come in here. I can't believe I made it over here all the way without getting caught. <laughs> it's not gonna last very long, by the way. Well done. Now let's see, where do they keep the mobos in there? It's cool, I got this.
magic non-clipper chip in that rocket, and ding, fries are done. The RC's not gonna be able to hold on to the board. Uh, damn, if only we had somebody there with working hands. <laughs> Touche. Okay, so how do we get up there now? That's the question. I could just go over there with the, uh... You know, my dad car, took me to but... the Air and Space Museum when I was like 10 years old. That was nothing compared to this. Rockets and dinosaurs, man. I mean, <laughs> you never outgrow them, right? <gasps> Greetings, fellow security personnel. Code 3, proceed to a bomb location. <laughs> Oh no! Oh no, I got spotted! Okay, did I turn it off? Okay, I'm gonna go upstairs. All we gotta do is install the motherboard. Oh my god, we're so close. Here we go. Oh my god. He's not here. We made it. Oh my god, we freaking made it. Oh my god, we freaking made it. This is this is next level shit right here, okay? Take out the old motherboard, or one of them at least. Put in the new motherboard. That looks so fancy. Nobody would ever suspect that I'm doing any of this. I mean, I look like money. This is what we do. All right, where's the funny bone at? Don't forget the water on the knee. Hey, Ray, you think I can officially put rocket scientist on my resume now? What do I look like? A career counselor? <laughs> hey, what is this? Course fairies paradox. Done. Yeah. Oh, beautiful. Now get out of there. And now we gotta get out of here. I had to stop that recording. I didn't want to interrupt Ray. Oh, no. No way. Hello. <laughs> Perfect. Oh my god, we executed that so freaking beautifully. <laughs> I cannot believe it. That actually happened. Oh, look at this. Oh, that's a nice car. So is that one. I don't think we've driven a convertible before, though. So. That one looks hella nice. Oh, that one's convertible, too. Oh, hold up. I'm sorry, man. I'm gonna leave you here. We're in the Galilei building. Galilei, Galileo, whatever. This is all money here. Oh, this is like a Ferrari. Delicious. And that, kids, is how you bug a satellite. I've got a sack <laughs> full of cookies waiting here for you. It'll be a while oh, before the rocket's ready to launch. We'll call you when it's time. Until then, go buy yourself some pretty. But, or don't. I mean, I don't really care what you do. Yes, there are no cookies. Man of the hour. Come on, Wesley Crusher. Launch waits. Oh, bitch, please. I'm clearly Cisco. <laughs> Jake Cisco. Captain Cisco. We are minutes away from having Bloom at our mercy. Well, we're gonna cook the shit out of there, Goose. T minus 20, 19, 18. What do I feel like this is not gonna go their go way? Back. You're just imagining that. Big data load is enough to get me to half mast and touching cloth at the same freaking time. Three, Three two, two, one. one. Lift off! Yeah. <laughs> Woo! Nice. Or maybe it did. What is this gonna. How is this gonna affect the story now? This can't be good. got to be some more drama pop up now due to that I mean, just... what 
<laughs> We're fucking Holy. happy. Look at that. Hell of a view up here. Time to blow the living shit out of Bloom. Bloom's network covers even more globe than we thought. Even a web this complex has to have a way in. What somewhere. I'm Fuck. picking up some points of entry. A few of these data hubs have their share of vulnerabilities. Love it. Let's go. Bro. What? Look at all this tech. Wrench, am I drooling? I'm sorry, I can't hear you over the sound of me drooling. You know your way around these servers, Josho? I think I can speak to them. Okay, so we hacked this. Mm. Alright, well, no yani shit. Upload the virus. Come through this room. Oh my god. That's pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. I can fucking space satellites? Like, what is that? That's insane. Uh oh. What was that? Josh, you oh, are okay, definitely okay, okay, the man. Okay, okay. Uh, We're good. Thank you, Ray. Now we got another power plant location. Oh my God! Bloom offices are in Yongsan. Let's make some music. Problem: SML gateway with adaptive security. No way through it. I could spend months and still get nowhere with this. No, there is always a way. Hey, what happens to data centers during a power outage? Their UPS kicks in. What else? What if that goes too? The firewall would drop. We'd be one step closer to Delaware. Wrench, that's brilliant. You should do that. Funny you should say that, Satara. What? What? Oh. Act to modify electrical grid. We're fucked. <laughs> Alrighty then. What the fuck did you more? do, Wrench? Shut down the power. Any other requests? <laughs> Why use a hammer when you have a wrench? That's what I'm about. Yeah, I pulled a stunt like that once, Wrench. Riots ensued. People died. Not that kind of thing doesn't bother you. Alright, so now we're at the Dublin office. Huh. Welcome to Dublin, Ireland, boys. Ah, I thought this was Dublin, Ohio. Let's look around, make ourselves at home. <clears throat> okay, hold on. What the hell? She's gonna go for the alarm. Look, I gotta look after this. I'll circle back shortly. Don't touch it. I'll hold. How you love? Okay. Security guru locked by PC. Now I'm waiting around to hand up me bum. Got it. Right. Uh huh. Password work. Uh, okay. Twenty four seven party. Yeah. Perfect. Of course. All right, love. There you go. Got him. Okay, how many more do we need? Invade uh, Bloom's data center. Ah. Hey, oh, shit, that's all we're of them. We're clear huh? to Delaware. What? He's right. Look, 
We've got access to Delaware. Time to get what we came for. Pretty goddamn spectacular. Let's get him. All right, great. Great success. All of Bloom's metadata is about to be ours. This is the big one. You got this. Whoa. Holy smokes. <laughs> this is crazy. Oh, shit. Look at the size of that. Guys, we still got this, right? Um, hold on. Oh my god. You Man, have they got really have this locked down. Bro, this is crazy. Are you kidding me right now? Activate. What is this here? Oh, it's another drum. Oh, that's cool. Alright, so we got this one. We, we need to... Hold on, we hey, need to activate Marcus. these. How's it going? You know, it's a little stressful doing this with all of you watch. Marcus. Marcus. Seriously? You're gonna do this now? Marcus! 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 <laughs> Shouldn't you Marcus, guys go fuck yourselves Marcus, or Marcus, Marcus, Marcus. <laughs> Come on, Marcus, baby, we got this. There we go. Okay. Got these, all of this side. Now we're gonna do this side. Gonna work on this. There's a lot of them, man. Holy smokes. Yeah, that one's good. That one's good. Oh, these are these are much more simple. Oh shit! Here we go. <laughs> Let's go, baby. Oh my god. Got it. I'm gonna leave these guys a little memento of my visit. Marcus, what are you up to? Nuh uh, it's a surprise. What? What? Hey, not yet. Did it work? Wait for it. <laughs> you see what I did there? Oh, mad skulls, bro. Yo, this is next level shit right here. We're, li we're literally hacking the entire fucking world right now. Well, not the world, but we're going around the world via satellite signal, okay? This is, I'm yes. telling you, this is gonna backfire. Marcus, you beautiful bastard. <laughs> okay, all right, okay. This is gonna make people angry, okay? Guys, guys, look. Oh, fuck. Oh. It'll take forever to go through all this. Uh, focus on why the satellites are in play. Ray. Yeah, I already got eyes on it. Holy loving fuck. It's a backbone. Satellite backbone? What about the latency? There's no way they can match the speed of fiber optics. If I'm reading this right, they are. Bloom did it. They're, they're bypassing the undersea cables with satellites. That's a quantum leap in tech. I mean, if this works, it'll take hackers years to catch up or... Yeah, yeah, not for us. We're already in. Hey, who's on Bloom's client list? We got Noodle. We got Is that Envi, weed we there? got Titus, we got Galloway, <laughs> Donuts? we got the, the government, the New York Stock Exchange. Wait, so all these companies just agreed to up and funnel all their data through Bloom? Does anyone else find that suspicious? Now, all that data at Bloom's fingertips, that's like the world's most powerful monopoly. Can we nuke the backbone? No, no, even if we could, we still need answers. Hey, everybody listen up. Our work is far from over, but with this score, at least we're on the playing field. So pick a target. Invite, Titus, Dibs. whatever, and start digging. Look for shit they're not supposed to be doing, right? Dushan wants to paint us as an enemy? Let's show him what going to war with us really means. Yeah. 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 <clears throat> hey, what's up? You know what's up. I saw those wheels spinning. 
Look, I don't want you using Marcus as your personal weapon against Bloom. Where the fuck is this coming from? I know about Raymond Kenny and his great collateral damage. We're using each other here. That was always the deal, Satara. Marcus is a big boy. He knows how to look after himself. Mm-hmm. Sure. Weird. <sighs> I know some of you told me we could trust Ray, man, but... In a free and just that... society, every person is treated with dignity. In a free and just society, leaders are accountable to those they govern. And in a free and just society, individuals can rise as far as their talents and hard work will take them. Do you believe your society is just? just? Do you believe you are free? free? Perhaps you trust in the power of democracy, democracy. that your vote counts. Vote, vote. Companies now buy politicians and manipulate elections. Do you believe in the power of the free market? The stock exchange is a puppet show for the rich. Your wealth is controlled by people you've never met. Never met. Do you believe the government protects you? National Defense now aims to protect the government from you. Don't take our word for it. Join us as we launch our biggest operation yet and see for yourselves. The foundations of U.S. policy have failed us all. Democracy, the free market, national security. DedSec will give you the truth. Do what you will. Eight research points. Now, I, I've been saying it, man. There's a little bit of a... There's a little bit of a... Hmm, I'm not sure about Ray. Like, it's like the, the story is kind of like hinting like there's something up with him. It might not be. But... I don't know. I might just be paranoid. I got trust issues, okay? Marcus, Josh is swimming through the deep end of the Galilee data... And he's got something he wants to show you. Cool. What's the scale of the thing? Come back home when you can. This might be big. Shanghai. Trigger a burst of speed in a vehicle. I'm gonna do that. You never know when you're gonna need that to escape the cops. <laughs> really high level members of gang to rough up your target. Damn, like that? Okay. <laughs> Shit. God damn. Okay. The APB wanted criminal. A false APB. This replaces the APB suspect located ability cost. Okay. This is just pretty much like a like an upgrade to the uh, to the upgrades we got on the last episode. We found a potential diamond in the Galilee dump with Titus's name on it. I'm listening. Wrench and I are working on a plan. Easier if we fill you in when you're back in the garage. I. So it looks like the man in the middle. This okay. is scary as fuck. Imagine what happens if Bloom takes CTOS global. Countries without any regulations. Countries where the government will actively use it against their people. It would be catastrophic. A nightmare scenario. And it's probably already in progress. So how do we even begin to stop it? We keep hitting their corporate allies. Expose the risks, the abuse. We're not fighting against Bloom itself. That's a losing battle. We've got to wreck its image and destroy its brand. What's up, Ray? Joshua picked up something strange from the Galilee hack. It's code, but the comments are in Chinese. Oh, tell me the Chinese didn't hack the satellite backbone already. Not the satellite. The submarine cables connecting China and the US. Hmm. That's not even the interesting drop your pants part. Bloom's been monitoring the hack. Joshua says the hackers are stealing data and using it to make a mint on the New York Stock Exchange. The hackers turned inside a trader, so it's not the first time it's happened. Yeah, we'll get this. The program the hackers are using? Drum roll, Josh, please. Pattern recognition software. Sure as shit looks like bellwether to me. And Bloom knows? So why are they sitting on it? Well, that's why we're talking. We have nothing solid to go on, except our Chinese hackers use their access to pre-clear a cargo ship landing in San Francisco. Their shipping containers just arrived at the port. I'll check it out. Hmm. All right, all right, that's it. That's it. We got it. 
Jesus Christ, child. So I want to say we can probably just... Yo, Sitara, hmm. what's the container number I'm looking for? LV426. <laughs> oh, seriously? You testing my geek food? A bit, yeah. It starts with SIBU707. <laughs> okay, I see it. But I got other containers in the way. Then I have to find a way to unblock it. Wait, is there nobody here or what? Oh, shit. Ooh. Okay. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna trust that this thing is not gonna dump that container on my head. <laughs> I'm just gonna go here. <laughs> I think it was GTA 5. I think it was. Jesus Christ. Come on. Calm down. Calm the fuck down. Are you hog tying this dude? <laughs> what the frick? Riddle me this. Who around here is Chinese and deals in human trafficking? Anti shoe boys for sure. Yeah. Well, there's some high end human smuggling like I ain't never seen before. His container is nicer than my last apartment. I'm sending you a picture. Got it. Who is he and why does he have a bloody nose? Noodle Translate isn't his friend. Hey, he's not your running the mill cargo either. Not sure what I can do with it. Let's see if he can match his face online. My guess, he's got an education if they went to all this trouble. Right. I'll start with Chinese schools and get back to you if I find something. Okay. Oh, and by the way, uh, welcome to America. Marcus, I found your guy. What you got? Graduate of Shanghai Jiao Tong University. He's got a double master's in statistic and business. He's a quant. They definitely need him to number crunch that stock market data, which means the auntie shoe boys are in the business of insider trading. I have a contact in Chinatown who's connected with the anti shoe boys. I'm sending you his coordinates. Maybe he can help you get answers. No! Shut up, bitch. We got this. Uh, 911, please state your emergency. Oh, look at the nitrous on your boy. Oh, shit. <laughs> It uses botnet charge. That's cool. Copy that. Block him on the other side. I got him here. Squad, be advised that a possible suspect or suspects have been reported near your location. Okay, this is not what I wanted to get into right now. I did not want to get into a high-speed chase with the popo. You understand? I'm just trying to make my way to Chinatown. That's all. Just leave me alone, damn it. I gotta be careful with the cops. Anyone check out the tunnels yet? Did that occur to anybody? <laughs> A Sorry. Car has been dispatched after the suspect. <laughs> I just really activated that, didn't I? I'm an absolute fucking idiot. Oh, we're here, so I guess, I guess that works. You know, when dead sec for oh, yeah! dude, what are you, Marcus? 
Hey, you know this guy? Sailing hoy po guy homong. Yeah, you're just full of attitude, aren't you? Look, I know the Auntie Shoe boys are bringing them in. I'm trying to find out why. No, I don't fucking know him. We don't all know each other. Satara said you could help me out. Give me something here. Why didn't you say so? Auntie Shu has an office in the import export company on Gold Street. They keep records there. But you tell Satara this makes us even. Yeah, yeah. Thanks. <laughs> that old lady was trying to talk to me. <laughs> okay, so really quickly, let me check something under this mission. Okay. Heads up. I'm checking up on a lead in Chinatown. I think it's an Auntie Shu safe house or something. I'll let you know if I find anything. Okay, keep an eye out for anything we can use related to the stock market hack. And on the third day, God decided we hadn't suffered enough, so he created this asshole. <laughs> he just said, and on the third day, God had decided we had not suffered enough, so he created this asshole. <laughs> That's going to be the funniest shit ever. Oh, yeah. Bye. Mm. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, they got dogs in here. There's a trespasser that out. How, dude? How? Report in. How? How the fuck? You didn't even see me. That dog really just gave him my location like that? Okay. Illegal shit you got going on here, huh? You know, fucked up now. Fucking hey, there's more of you. 911, what's your emergency? A shootout going on right now. Who the hell are you guys? Oh my god, the cops are coming. Come on, come on, come on. Cops are here. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. <clears throat> Alright, so we're under escaping right now, so we're good. We're extra good. Now this is promising. Let's see what you're hiding. You got anything good? Documents. You read Chinese? <laughs> nah, but I do read maps and diagrams. Maps and diagrams of what? Looks like a floating server farm. Computer nodes, generators. They're in international waters somewhere near the China-US cable. The Pacific Fleet's been chasing boats and submarines away from that thing for years. But that's a lot of wet to cover. Not when they also feed you coordinates. Thank you, Auntie Shoe Boys. Great. Now get out of there. You got cash for me? No? <gasps> no? What's the plan, Stan? Hack the barge, get an inside peek, and maybe find out why Bloom is letting someone use Bellwether on the stock market. Only problem is, it's out of range. Okay. The barge won't be linked to CTUS, and she'll use Chinese protocols. But I've got a fix for you. Easy peasy. I'll patch you in on my side. Just get your phone to a clear location. I'm sending you coordinates to a lighthouse in Marin. Make sure you look around. The view's spectacular, hacker. Oh That was an entrance. I'm, 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 I'm sorry. I apologize. I didn't mean to do that. I, I'm really sorry. Okay. I just, what, what do you want me to tell you? I am seriously thinking about it. Okay. So. My friend Stacy. See, there it is again. 
What is that? I don't think I have the slightest idea on how to get up there. So what I'm gonna do is, how about if we go? I'm gonna jump up here. Excuse me, guys. You're gonna have to move out the way. Move out of the way. Uh oh, this is not good. We're calling the police. Here we go. Screw this. Here we go. Perfect. That was freaking awesome. Paint job at the 3D printer. Don't mind if I do. And here we go. The last and final mission for today's episode, guys. Okay. Okay, I made it and I'm good to go. Hey, Ray, no lie about the view. I do not lie, my friend. Uh-huh. You two play nice. You ready, Ray? Yep. Protocols are ready for you. I'm gonna see what's up with that barge. That's a pretty view. Gotta be honest. Are we going back to the satellite? Oh. Back into the barge. What's the plan? If I read the blueprints right, and I know I did, it's got cameras that I can hack. I'm going for an inside peek. And then what? Hijack the shit out of it as soon as I figure out how. That's crazy. I love it. I want their main server, and that means bringing it closer to us. I'm going inside. We're going inside, boys. Come on, man. Don't keep us in suspense. What do you see? Damn, they're not fucking around here. I see a lot of top-end hardware. I also see an admin terminal, but I'll need to snoop around and find some login credentials. I already got the credentials, baby. That's all. All I gotta say. I think I found the password. You read Chinese. It's a numerical sequence. Can't hurt to try. Hey, hey now, someone here likes toys. Josh toys or Zatara toys? The kind that needs batteries. The <laughs> kind I can control remotely. Now you're just playing with me. <laughs> oh, I see. Oh, little gnome. Can I go through here? Going through the vents. And escape. Yeah, I like this, man. This is really cool. Some cool shit right here, man. Okay, well, now what? Oh, we have access to this door already. And oh, really? Already here? Dude, that was fast. Now this room looks important. Uh, there we go. This is it. why we love people who check that little remember me box. I found a login name. I think I have what I need to access the ship systems. Sweet. Get yourself back to the admin terminal. And now the question is, how do we get there? Oh. Here we go. <laughs> I'm done. Back to access. I'm in. Any idea how you're bringing the barge in closer to shore? You should totally spoof the fuel gauges. Make them think they have a leak. <laughs> yeah, sounds good. Okay, I spiked the fuel gauges. Made them think they're low on fuel. They're coming in to gas up. Nice. That's genius. We've got a boat waiting for you at the Marin docks. What are we supposed to do now, though? Just wait? Dude, that's actually fucking genius. I don't know if hackers have that much power, but hey, <laughs> that's pretty crazy. So it looks like we're back at the same spot we started. I don't know if you guys remember this spot, but <laughs> this is the same spot. We <laughs> oh, look at this fucking beautiful game. Retro, I line this up for you. 
Nice. You coming with? This is all yours. <clears throat> when the barge comes in range, this will get you there fast. We about to get that speedboat. Mm, okay. Fucking do this. All right, baby. Marcus, I timed every barge hack with activity on the New York more. Stock Exchange. Every time, it matched up with periods leading up to volatile trading all the way back to 2007. 2007? Wait, you saying the financial crisis was... An early bellwether test to manipulate buying and spending patterns on an already susceptible market. But how did the Auntie Shoe Boys have access to it that early? Unless... Unless they were given the access to it? Plausible deniability? Maybe. That's the fucking Coast Guard, bro. What am I doing? I think. I don't know. Oh my god. I reached the barge. Keep the line open. You're out there without a lifeline. I promise not to drown. I'm going in. Wish me luck. Bro, are we really hacking this entire fucking boat? Well, the ship. I realize that you can't really like dive in this game. Can you dive? Why is it so dark out? Dude, the water's so fucking nice looking. They did such a great job at that. Okay, so we're here. There's a lot going What's your on plan? here, guys. There may be hundreds of servers on board a ship of that size. I need to hack the admin terminal to locate the server we want. Yeah. Today is not your lucky day, bud. Mm -mm. Not today. Go, 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 go. Contractors on Fuck it then. We gonna go ramble on their ass? We going ramble on their ass? Yeah? <laughs> yeah, you wanna fuck it, you want that heat, bitch? Oh my ear. Oh my god. I can't listen now. What have you done to my ear? I've hacked the shit out of it. Reinforcements have been called. This is not good. Well, on the bright side, they've opened the door, so I don't even need to hack into it to open it. I just needed this. Ah, that should do. See if the back door is still good. I found the main server on their system, just need to physically locate it. What they describe as portable may not be what you're thinking. Oh? How big you think this thing is? Industrial size. I'll keep the line open. Let me tell you, just going balls deep is very freaking fun in this game. Like, I get it. I get that, you know, it's good to hack and, you know, sneak around and all this. But going balls deep, bro. Ah, don't report this. What are you doing, bro? <laughs> going back to sleep. That's what you're doing. All right, let's see if we can control this. Found the server. How exactly am I getting this off the boat? The blueprints you found show a service elevator shaft. They say that shaft is a bad mother. Shut your mouth. I'm talking about elevator shaft. <laughs> I can dig it. Get the server up on deck and we'll take care of the rest. Yeah, how the hell were we supposed to do this without taking these guys out? I mean, I'm sure you can, but that would have been a pain in the ass. happening here where are you you should see me right about now what am i looking holy shit that's no moon 
Is that your drone? Surprise. Custom built for us. Look at it. <laughs> what the freaking shit was that? What just happened? Oh, oh god. Oh shit. Stop looking fucking down. Oh god. Okay. Okay. Oh. What? Fuck. Hey yo, Josh, man. How many times have you flown this thing? Oh, I thought I lost the mission, dude. That forklift got stuck there. You know, Michelle, we're just glad that these hackers were finally brought to justice. It frankly shows a flaw in the system from the submarine cables to the spying and sabotage by groups like DedSec. Now, I will tell you this. Bloom is working on a product that will eliminate this problem. Fucker gave the hackers bellwether access so they could test it for it. Then spun the attack as a vulnerability on the submarine cables. Gotta hand it to the Thanks asshole. Time. I gotta you know more companies are gonna sign up for Bloom's satellite pipeline. Okay, so we release everything we have on Duchamp, okay? Let the public hang him like they did fucking Mussolini. Breaking his neck isn't the answer. Well, man. sitting on our asses isn't either, okay? No, but for once, what I want Shut up! Do He's baiting us. Think. He's trying to neutralize us one last time as a threat. And we are a threat. We agreed, all of us, to play this thing out on our own terms. Has that changed? Good. We almost have everything we need to hurt him permanently. So let's all get back to work and let's bring this thing home. Hmm? All right, so the next two missions or operations that we have are Power to the Sheeple and Robot Wars. I think after we finish those two, then we get the final mission. We're very close to the end, and I'm excited. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. As always, if you did, drop it a like, and uh, hopefully we'll finish this game by, by next week, by this coming week, the next two, three days at most, which is much faster than I was even planning to, but uh, yeah, catch you later.